hope you're enjoying all the lovely weather outside so sunny so hot hope you're having a great time well today i've got a really simple easy quick recipe for you today we're going to make colorful pancakes i did actually make some before and then um, this is the ones that i've done before there you go look all different colors we've got purple green yellow and beautiful beautiful blue but you can just make whatever colour you like. Basically, I've done different colour um, batters. So we've got blue batter, purple batter, pink batter, yellow batter and green batter. And it's very, very, very simple. So first of all, the first thing we do is we put a cup of plain flour into the mixing bowl. Like that. One cup. Okay. And then what we do is we put a cupful of milk into the same bowl. Like that very easy there's no measuring we're just doing it with cups so that's very easy for everyone to do then we put a little teeny weeny bit of salt just a little shake of salt there and then we're going to break our eggs into another cup so there's one cup here one egg here and two that's the second egg going in there okay and then we're just going to pop our eggs into the mixture here and then we're going to start stirring. Okay, so we're going to stir it all around. You can see, into a lovely batter. So just keep stirring, round we go, round and round we go. That's it, and then we've got to try and get all the lumps out. So we're going to have to do some fast stirring, like so. Okay, nearly there, nearly all the lumps are out. Okay, so just keep giving it a good stir and get some air into it as well. Okay, and it should be like the cons like double cream. So that's the sort of consistency you're looking for. Everyone. Right, now we're over this side of the kitchen. So we've got our batter mixture. We've got our plate to put our pancakes on. We've got some butter or margarine, which we're going to put a small amount in our frying pan. You might need help with this part. So this part, you have to be very careful. So first of all, your butter goes into your frying pan, like so. If you have a family member in your house, then I think you might need help with this a little bit. Okay, so I've got a ladle, which is really useful. So you get a ladle of your batter mixture and pour into your frying pan. One ladle normally covers the whole of a frying pan, like so. And then literally we're leaving it on the heat. And eventually you will see little bubbles dispersing on the top of the pancake. And that will mean it's time to turn it over. So this just takes a, a little minute or two. So while we're waiting for the pancake to cook, I'm just going to show you, I put strawberries and chocolate chips on my cookies, but you can put cream, you can put any toppings you like, but chocolate chips and that and strawberries is very nice. You might have some blueberries, you might have some apple, you might have some grapes that you'd like to put onto your pancakes. Any sort of fruit topping is beautiful and very, very nice. Also, you could just have lemon and sugar, which is the traditional things that we have on pancakes. So my pancake is starting to cook. As you can see, the edges are starting to get cooked. So then we just get our, we just get our frying pan and we're gonna turn it over like so. So you can see the frying pan, the pancake in the frying pan. So that is going to make sure it's not sticking. The Susan in a minute is gonna attempt to Throw the pancake, let's hope it doesn't land on the ceiling of Pinagree. So, are you ready for this? Ready, steady, one, two, three. Whee! There it goes. Whee! And that's how you flip a pancake. Okay, so we're just going to keep on cooking it a bit longer. A bit more on that side. 
get ready because Susan's going to flip it again. One, two, three. Whoop. Over we go. Oh, this one's got a bit stuck. There we go. <laughs> Flipped over. Oh, this is fun. I think you're going to have a lot of fun making these at home, guys. But we have made these loads of times at Pinny Green, if you remember. And everybody really, really enjoys making them. But also nice on them is chocolate spread and jam and lovely things like that. Okay, I think we're nearly there now with our lovely pancake. Turn it over a little bit. Just needs to be a little bit browner. There we go. What should we do? One more flip, one for one for good luck. Whee! There you go. Okay, so that's ready. Now the pancake's done. So what we do now is we, we turn up our heat and we put on our plate. And then we bring it over to the table and I've got some strawberries which I'm going to cut up and put on top. Very easy guys to make these pancakes. I'm sure you're going to really enjoy making them and you can make them for your brothers, your sisters, your aunties, your uncles. Everybody can have a go. And I've got my lovely chocolate chips and there you go. Very simple, easy pancakes to make at home. Hope you enjoy them.